Okay, guys, so it sounds good so far. Yeah, those 3D billboards sound very cool. Well, I've got my man, Nate Shepard, here. Well, the first thing we were thinking about is we're going to do some, uh, some banner ads. Banner ads? Then we do a Twitter page, which is Twitter. Nate was a very successful. You just missed out on a million dollar low job. Failure. Boobie. That moron dick got a million dollar Christmas bonus last year. I need stability. And his relationship. Call me crazy, but when someone dumps me, I like to get as far away from that person who's dumping me. Is over. You don't have to leave tonight. You know I get scared. The last thing he needs now. Hi. Is a new roommate. This would just be a temporary situation. Two friends helping each other out in a time of need. Two people helping each other out. They'd be practically... Strangers. Strangers. I put together some guidelines for us to follow as roommates. Commandment number one. Thou shalt not leave womanly things visible in thy garbage for thy roommate to bear witness to. Jenny! Sorry. Number two. Thou shalt not allow any pets or furry mammals into thy loft. <coughs> Bless you. Bless you. Number three. Thou shalt not make too much noise whilst eating. Bam, 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 bam. Bam. Thou shalt not play radio or television too loudly whilst thy roommate is writing. Whoa, whoa. But can a man find happiness? Are you drunk? Maybe. Let's go against one of your commandments. No. With someone who breaks all his rules? <gasps> but that does. Are you kidding me or what? She just may be. Jenny, we need to talk. The one thing. I don't know what I would have done if I hadn't come here. You. I've done so much for me. I love you. And I, I love you too. That makes the most difference of all. What's number 10? Thou shalt not cover thy roommate. Thou shalt not cover thy roommate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Steve Gutenberg, Shannon Elizabeth, Milena Govich. New Films International presents a novel romance. Where are they already? Sounds like Jenny's gotten over it. <laughs>